Hey, uh, welcome back. I'm Zod. Uh, welcome back to our uh, Legend of Zelda Ocarina Time playthrough. Um, we are actually going to do some things out of order here if I can actually accomplish this. I think I, yeah, I can. All right, cool. Here's the cutscene I wanted. Let's do it. All right. You destroyed the wicked creatures that haunted the temple and awakened the sage. But there are still other sages who need your help. In order to awaken all the other sages, you must become even more powerful. You must travel over mountains, underwater, and even through time. Mm -hmm. If you want to return to your original time, return the Master Sword to the pedestal of time. By doing this, you will travel back in time seven years. Yep, we'll be a kid again. The time will come when you will have to return here quickly. I will teach you this for when that time comes. The song to return you to the Temple of Time, the Prelude of Light. Got it. Right. Let's do it. That will also make it a lot easier for us just to move around. You have learned the Prelude of Light. It's a beautiful song. Uh, as long as you hold the Ocarina of Time and the Master Sword, you hold time itself in your hands. Zod, we shall meet again. Whoosh! <laughs> All right. Sheik. What a weird name. All right. Did you just drop your swords? Poop. Alright. Done. Perfect. Alright. Uh some of you guys might some of you guys that played this might know what I'm gonna go do. We just beat the forest temple. By the way, guys, don't forget you can catch me on my Twitch channel uh three days a week, uh Sunday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, it'll be a uh, twitch.tv slash Garrison. Uh, link will be in the description. Uh, also, catch my podcast, guys, if you like survival horror stuff, movies, games, books, um, any kind of survival horror, just like apocalyptic stuff. Um, yeah, uh, the Shambling Horror Podcast on Spotify, uh, Apple, Google Podcasts, all the things. I appreciate all you guys. Um, yeah, episode one is up. Uh, we do those on Fridays on my Twitch channel if you guys ever want to pop in live. We do uh, fun stuff. We got a live, um, you live broadcast chat. Um, we have a call in number. It's it's really fun. Um, but yeah, let's go, let's go uh, make our uh, dreams become memes. Let's go over this way. Um, it's funny as I'm not technically supposed to do what I'm about to do yet, but I'm just gonna go do it because I don't give a shit. It's fine. <laughs> I want to get the heart piece that uh, uh, I can very easily get from getting this. That's literally like the only reason I want to get it. <laughs> All right. Uh, I fucking hate that mini game, and I'm getting ready to go get the ability to cheat that mini game. All right. You guys know what I'm talking. Some of you guys know what I'm talking about. If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't. It's fine. All right. This is also one of my favorite parts in the entire game. I'm about to make a dude shit his pants. He's about to shit his pants. Liquid, liquid poop. Right. <laughs> Here we go. So I can remember. Where is it? Some storms. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. Whoops. Wait, it's... Oh, I got it. It's... There we go. Ba -do -do, boo, ba -do 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 -do. <laughs> Watch it. <It's> a... <laughs> oh, this is like my favorite part. This dude freaks out. Freaking out, dude. 
<laughs> Look at this dude's eye. Ah! Going round and 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 round. So yeah, so basically, well, you guys will see. Jumping in the well. Jumping in the well. All right. It's a dungeon, guys. Ooh, it's a dungeon. We're at the bottom of the well. You're not even technically supposed to do this until I think after you beat the um, the water temple like portion, but we're gonna do it anyway because I just don't give a shit. All right. And I also really like this little mini dungeon. It's a sort of a optional. Well, this dungeon's not optional, but like this portion is. Well, part, a part of this dungeon is optional, I should say. Alright. So what's really cool about this is there's invisible walls. Although, what's funny is you can sort of see them. Now that, like, I don't remember it being that janky, but, like, you can literally see the open. I just didn't feel like dealing with this stupid ass. Let's see. Isn't there something else here? Can I blow that up? Man. Yeah. See, I remembered. I've played this before. I got bomb shoes! Sweet! I have a bunch of those already. Thanks, game. <laughs> I know, I really do. I got them super early. I was doing, um... Isn't there a hole here to fall down? Maybe not. It's all good. I thought I could have swore there was another, like, door over here. I know there is a hole somewhere. There's a pitfall somewhere around here. Right there. Fuck. It's all good. Damn it, dude. Let's actually, um, uh, put... Uh, well, let's put this here, and it's a sun song, remember. All right, let me see. Uh, okay. It's not a redead, like, right? He's right there. I could I could use Din's fire too and just kill him, but save my magic. Just save my magic. It's all good. Oh wait, no, I wanna keep that on there. What's over here? Nothing? Is there really nothing over there? That's crazy. All right. All right, let's grab... Ow. Hey, 
No, dude. Yeah, I'm annoyed I'm in the basement. I'm wasting all my bombs and everything. Alright, I'm not wasting any more bombs. I'm gonna grab one of these guys and use it. I'm probably just gonna put Din's fire on. I'm tired of this. <laughs> All right, I'm just pissed off into the basement. I also get magic every time I kill one of those. I think I get the compass down here. It's fine. It's unnecessary. I don't think I actually needed to come down here in the basement, but it's whatever, dude. It's all good. <coughs> Eleven minutes. All right. The compass would be nice. Uh, so what happens in this mini dungeon is you get the item that you need. You can get it relatively early and you don't actually have to explore anything else in this dungeon. But it's all good. I don't remember the exact order that you should actually go in. So we'll just take it as we go. It's all good. We need to find... <clears throat> there should be a Triforce symbol on the ground around here somewhere. Where? There it is. Alright. I see you. Should be Zelda's lullaby? song yeah that should kill the water okay okay we actually need to oh, nope I didn't want to do that all right so let's go back now that we drain the water, actually, let's go through there. There might actually be a key or so stupid shit. <sighs> Can't believe this shit. <laughs> I'm in the basement again, dude. Uh, the basement again. <laughs> to the basement. Oh my god, dude. How many times am I gonna get banished to this goddamn basement, dude? I need a basement counter. Uh... <clears throat> Alright, we can go down here, which I think is where this last key we need is. Uh, well, last. I say last, but... Hearts, sir. All right, is this the creepy, freaky boss, dude? Yep, this is the coolest boss in the whole game. F like for real. Oh shit! Here he comes. Off, off, get off. Fuck it, off. Where is he? There he is. Do I 
I stun him? I don't remember what I need to do here. You know what's funny? I wonder if I can actually, uh... I wonder... Can I just use Stin's fire and roast this Oh shit. I didn't mean to do that. Uh... Yeah, I'm trying to eat. You know, this is super easy. You just, just, just stand here and hit him. You can do this whole fight without ever getting hit once. <clears throat> there he is. All right, greedy, greedy, greed. It's gonna come back to bite you in the ass, son. Come back up. There he is. Come on, give me my lens of truth, bruh. So I can get the hell out of this dungeon. Get, get, get. Nope. Bring on. Back. Come back! I'm not done playing. I wanna play. Somebody wants to play. I just want to tickle you until you're giggling. There you're dead. That's like the creepiest boss in the whole game. It's easily the creepiest boss in the whole game. Um, I really like uh, Volvagia because I like the name. Um, and uh, <laughs> and I also just like that boss. I actually think it's really cool. But uh, I think it's probably like the best boss in the Well, the, the, this is really cool. Uh, so with this lens, um, no, what I was going to say is the best boss, I think personally, is the the witches, but um, it's not a spoiler, I guess. But so this thing is neat. So um, you can go, uh, you can use this thing to essentially, it uses your magic, but you can use it to see stuff. So like, let me see, is there any, I don't think there's any pots in here, is there? Um, can actually see, isn't there like a secret in here yeah although you know i mean we already have a full wallet yeah you can use it to see hidden stuff um meaning we're getting ready to go we're getting ready to go kill that mini game actually i wonder can we teleport out of here I don't think we can, but uh, if I play this right now, will it teleport us out? It should be. No, no. Uh, oh, it's OK. I had it back. Should be. Did I? Am I remembering this wrong? What the? F oh, jeez. It should be up, up, right, up, right, left, up. All right. So it should be up, right, up. Wait, damn. Up. Right, up, left, right, up. No. Damn it. No, dude! All right, up, right, up, right, left, up. God, jeez. Let's see if it teleports me back from here. I'm in a dungeon, technically. I don't think, yeah. No, oh, cool. So we'll port me there. Nice. Uh, Cause I wanted to get out of here like I'm done. Uh, I already got the lens of truth like Poo-poo all that other shit in there, I don't care. Alright. 
because now what we'll do is we will go uh, make that mini game guy wish he was never born right now. <laughs> All right, let's go this way. What's cool is now that we have the lens of truth, I think we can talk to these guys. Right? Oh, no, we need the mask. Uh, that's a spoiler, I guess, but it's all good. <laughs> I don't know if I need nighttime to play this or not. I don't think I do. I mean, should only need 20 rupees and it should be it. Is it this door? Treasure to yeah, I hope it's at night. Um... Sun song. Alright. Time to go cheat this guy out of his income. Alright. I'm pissed because it's like the only heart piece I couldn't get. Yes, sir. Alright. Got the key. So now what we'll do is this. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna cheat him. <laughs> this minigame sucks, dude, if you're not if you don't uh if you don't have this lens. It's absolutely brutal. It's brutal, it's just brutal. Like I know it's dumb because it's like a one in fit it's a 50-50 like coin flip, but it's just brutal. You have to do this so many times to get through here. Like, imagine having to guess 50-50 correctly, like... Look at all these times you have to collect, 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 All right. Got it. Give me that heart piece, baby boy! Got it. All right. Nice. All right. I think that'll do it for us. All right, guys, that'll do it for us. Uh, thank you so much for uh, enjoying this episode of our Legend of Zelda playthrough. Um, if you like this video, obviously, uh, definitely don't forget to feel free to like and subscribe. Uh, we're trying to push that uh, thousand follower goal, but by the end of the year, it's only January now, so I'm sure we'll get there. Uh, but uh, I appreciate every single one of you. Um, catch me on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash Garrisod, uh, three days a week. Um, Sunday, Wednesday, Fridays. Um, gaming playthroughs, just chatting, like a variety of content's fun. We do workout streams on Wednesdays. Um and don't forget to check out my podcast. The link is in the description. Shambling horror. It's all survival horror stuff. And uh, I will catch you in the next one, guys. Bye.